Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another video. It is Monday, April 15th, and it is a few minutes after 7 a.m. in the morning. So instead of going in my garden this morning, I have decided to take a walk around my neighborhood. I am not sure how far I will be walking, but I need to get some garden treasures, especially some cardboard to lay on the ground of my garden because I have been noticing some weeds coming up in some of the areas that I am in on a daily basis. So come along and take this walk with me to see what we are going to discover. So yesterday while um, we were coming from church, I saw something that I would pretty much like to get to put in my garden. But, <laughs> you know, I was all dressed up and everything, so I didn't want to stop and pick it up. But instead of going directly to that path, I want to walk all the way around because I need to get my steps in this morning as well. So, um, the reason why I want to get my steps in is because a few months ago I have decided to, um, to take a more holistic approach towards my health and I have been doing a plant-based diet uh, from December 15 to be exact. I have already lost 15 pounds and I believed with all my heart that if I was working out you know I would have lost some more weight I don't only want to lose the weight but I also want to be healthy and strong and you know when we age we lose the muscle mass so I need to get some more muscles in my arms my legs overall my entire body so um i am trying i'm gonna start trying to make this a part of my lifestyle where i walk on a regular basis and make it more consistent to see the end result i know i am not able to do this by myself i have to depend on the Lord Jesus Christ because he is the one that motivates me he is the one that gives me strength he is the one that has been keeping me when my mind is all um uh, what should I say crammed with a lot of stuff overthinking things you know work family everything we just have to depend on the Lord Jesus Christ. And I want him to lead me in the direction that I have to go. Can you all believe the school bus is just coming? My husband had to take my son to school because the bus is so late. Oh my goodness gracious. But I'm giving God thanks because I'm amongst the living and not amongst the dead you know being alive is a privilege it is a blessing because so many has gone to their beds last night and they never woke up some woke up they never woke up in their right mind they woke up with disabilities that they didn't have last night so many things could have gone wrong but I am here to give the Lord glory honor and praise this morning 
in spite of everything he said and everything we must give thanks all right guys so i am at this location here where i normally get my boxes and this is the back of a furniture store uh there are some boxes in the in the trash here boxes on pieces of boxes um but i think i will be getting some pieces from this one i brought my scissors so i'm gonna be cutting some pieces of this box guys to take it back to my garden i'm not sure if i'm gonna do it now i might go and finish my walk first or should i do it now hmm. i think i'm going to do it now guys so i have to climb over this part right here my gloves Alright guys, so <clears throat> I'm not far away from home, so I'm going to take some of the cardboard back to my garden and then I will come back for whatever is left or I can retrieve it. Well, either way, I will be coming back to retrieve it. Okay. So I guess I'll, I'll see you in the garden, guys, because I know this is going to be very awkward trying to carry this cardboard. Uh, I did brought some bags with me, but the, the cardboard cannot hold in the bag. So see you on the other side. So, guys, I managed to bring all of the cardboard with me. Every last piece of it, I have to fold them in small pieces and then fold it under my arm like this and then I have to switch arms every now and then yeah but that is my cardboard that I've just retrieved so now that I have gotten my cardboard I am heading back out and this time I will be going in the the other direction to see if I can um find anything else so See you out there on the road. So guys, I am approaching one of my dumpster areas and I have already seen something that I know I am going to love. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm just trying to get closer to see if there's any damages to this bin that I see. There's actually some damages to it, but I 
think there's something that I can use for a pin post. It has two nice handles here. Might be getting this, and then there is that stand over there a metal stand, old TV stand. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to carry this, but this could actually be a great stand to put some flower pots on or something. Guys, what do you all think? I think this is a jackpot. Uh, anyways, guys, I don't think I'm going to be able to carry both of them because I am just like three minutes away from my house. So, so I'm going to take um, the trash can back first and then I'll come and get the stand right here. Once again, I will see you on the other side, but I'm going to show you after I'm done bringing both items back. Oh Lord, have mercy. I haven't done this for a while and I feel so good, guys. I feel so, so good. To God be the glory. Great things he has done. So guys, I know I said I was going to show you both items as soon as I brought them back to the house, but look what I took back with me my wheelbarrow <laughs> to transport the table <laughs> i know i was not gonna be able to pull this off you know it's not really heavy but um i actually thought of putting it in my wheelbarrow to make the transition easier for me but this time around y'all not gonna see when i'm pushing this thing on the road in my wheelbarrow right Ah, uh, ah, uh, I know you would like to see it, but I don't know if this is something that we can do together. I'm going to try it though. If I can, I'll show you a little part of it. But if not, I'll see you on the other side. You know what guys, I honestly thought I should have just come and gotten to this thing all by itself because it's very light. Now how the heck am I going to push it on the wheelbarrow? Hmm, I might just have to put this thing over my shoulder and then drag my wheelbarrow along with me. Well, since I am not far from home, I'm just going to take the wheelbarrow back and come right back for this stand. I hope and pray that it's still gonna be here when I get back though. Cause I don't know how many persons is actually out there looking for stuff for their garden or for their homes. I don't know, or for their thrift store. You never can tell. But I will see you guys in a few minutes. Be right back. So I am back. I'm back for my stand. And I am going to put this on my shoulder. Oh, like this. And this is how I'm gonna be carrying it, guys. So at least you can see. Ah, oh, this is a little bit awkward though. Which way should I hold it? Which is the better way for me to hold it? Is it this way? Uh, well, I think so. It's not heavy. And it's gonna worth carrying. I think my finger is over my camera. Oh, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> I don't have my tripod because I was not planning on recording this part. How the heck am I gonna hold this camera now, guys? 
gotta find a way. All right. So this is how I do it. This thing is squeezing my shoulder though. So guys, I'm gonna end it here and I'll see you on the other side. And this is definitely where this bin is going to be until I find its sweet spot. So here is the stand in its temporary place in my garden. Ah. <laughs> Well, until I can find another sweet spot for it. Yeah, but it's looking really nice right here. So, until next time, guys, continue watching. Don't forget to comment, like, share, and also hit that notification bell. So whenever I upload the videos, you will be notified. And I guess, one of my future projects is going to be getting some shelves on this um, stand for my pots. Hmm. I already have some great ideas. So I'll see you guys soon.